So, uh, it's November 8th, 2020. I was just in the Plan Dome Starbucks on their NSA surveillance feed. Uh, it was like coming through the radio in the ceiling, like the radio, this thing, right? But in the ceiling, oh my goodness, it was like normally I like a good beat and I get into a good like drum beat, but the VIN, V I N, into the ear. Wow, the dialectic. <gasps> okay, so now here's the thing. Uh, the word eclectic means like I'm a collector and I collect things. Great. Okay, but here's the thing. Um, your dialect and your language is what wards off evil spirits is what we used to say. Um, you are a genetic something that belongs in a genetic group that has a genetic dialogue and, and dialect that keeps you healthy, safe, and you pray, and you do, you speak to one another, you have family, you have culture, you have whatever. Great. That's what keeps you safe from invasion, from all sorts, from disease. It keeps you having a life worth living. So now why is it that, uh, I am here? I am here for a different purpose, so don't put me into your, uh, whatever. I'm allowed to be eclectic because I am a watcher, a guardian. I am not human. I am a boa, B-O-A, which means I am serpentine. I am more than, and I was just saying this. I mean, if you, if you know Santaria, uh, uh, there's a Mexican something. If I'm making a jambalaya, I'm putting a Mexican, a Senegal, then I'm going to put a Santarian, maybe just a little pinch of a voodoo, voodoo, voodoo. Yeah, don't get me involved in this. Yeah, no, I'm not. Just uno momento, por favor. It's muy importante por Um, I have to... Sur so what I did inside is there was a... A girl in there, I don't know where from, I'm not even taking a gander on that, um, because I'm in a cesspool of everybody could be from anywhere, and your dialects mean nothing to me, because all your VINs are out and expired, and none of you are keeping anyone safe. In fact, your eclectic method between your, like, skin and your speech, it is like, holy fucking shit, you are causing yourselves cancer and all sorts of genetic anomalies and problems in the future, I can't even keep you safe. And I don't want to anymore. I'm the red boa, R-E-D. I am the true red blood in a human form tuned perfectly for my mission with a true blue, which I also am. And I have a lot, I have a genetic closet that is so stock chocked full that I really hate being amongst the humans because I like going as a human looker, observer, whatever, red boa, into my quiet place and do my terraforming to protect you. What I don't like to do is hang out amongst you and have you virally plague my eyes, my ears, show up in places I don't want to fucking see you, meet you, whatever. So anyway, so I'm in there and now listen. I go high, I go low, like, I do cholo security, I, I mean, when I, you're terraforming, you write the dialect that then you gift to the people. But I own the language and the words and the glue that holds them together, or you're a clicker. From now on, I'm not giving you any fucking words, you'll just click yourself to, like, understand something. So now, uh, here we are in Metcalf, uh, the Reich, what the fuck happened, uh, since I don't know what your centurion Roman looks like, is he like Moroccan, North African, or is he like Sudanese, uh, what does the Pope look like these days, I mean, he used to be proper, Britannia, Germanic, like, Polish, maybe, Russian, I don't know, is it like Croatia, Albania, I don't know, it's hard to... When, when the, uh, when you're calling me at, like, I don't know anything and I don't know the world map, you're, you're telling me the Armenians, uh, are reporting that they look Pakistani, and I'm like, oh, oh, I'll take your order, thanks, for eclecticness for later from Metcalf, but I don't know how to protect you, because I don't know what that means. I don't know what that looks like. I don't have documents, I don't have, like, a photo array in front of me. 
with a placemat. So anyway, so I'm inside Starbucks. It's all caught on film. And then I got the arrow nav, like open a hole and oops, snapshot. There we go. <laughs> There's my wife, like, you know, in your pornography, eclecticness of liberty and cancer for all in really dangerous genetic ways. And we just want you all to like close the book. Um, so I asked her, I said, it's, you know, I said, it's like surfing the wave of dialect. I said, I, I go high, I go low, you know, like, it's not, you know, whatever. I was like, so now, um, I was like, it just, sometimes it bothers me. Like whatever he's saying is really bothering me because there's words, there's meaning behind whatever he's saying, uh, especially in that moment. So I said, um, now it like spiritu remo, like, um, I said, if I told you spiritu remo, like I'm a abuela, I was like, does that make sense? And she goes, actually, yes, it does. And I go, okay, great. I said, now, where is Santa, I said, where's Santa, Santaria, right? I said, where, where's that, where's that located? Like, who does that? I know, like, voodoo is Haitian, en français, they're great, whatever. But who does Santaria? I can't find anybody who can tell me that. So she goes, I think they're Dominican. I was like, great. Okay, so now I know. French, half, I guess, a quarter, half, whatever, and then you have it, Espanol is the other half. Now, one has voodoo, who do you do, and they keep bon français away, and there's no middlemen in the island. That's what the crazy white chick is for if she has questions, she asks each individually, but we don't share things with whatever, because we don't do eclectic. Now, here we are in that brings me back for the Senegal and the Mexican who wants to get me in trouble by saying that his Senegal look is Mexican. And I'm like, right, yeah, you are part of that Southeast Asian problem with my Anastasia, 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 Anastasia. Let's see, how else might I explain the bear in the lion's den? I don't know. Um, so, and then there's the uh, America, which I think is the Puerto Rican, because to the Dominican and the Singali, like Mexican, he was like, oh, you're Puerto Rican? Well, then, and, oh, and you hang out with the Cuban? Right, yeah, okay, so we got Cuba and Puerto Rico on the American which is the cane of the two dogs, meaning uh, Jason Peter Romer, ugly as all fucking hell. And then the good-looking white kid, short, stupid convict. Like, th so now you allow, as humans, the most important red boa, like Chicana, but, like, not, I mean, who deals with you, like, I don't care who the hell you or what you call yourselves, and I gotta get to terraforming places. Right, and you all believe in it and know it to be true, to keep yourself safe, you don't share your shit, except for, like, with the gods, which is fine, because they're trying to help you stay safe and keep the others out of your business, uh, and provide for you some safety equipment, oh, like, get out of this grid. Right, that's what I am here for, in Terraform. So why the fuck am I being plagued by every cholo and uh, every... Chicana and like thinking that they should pick my mates for who I should have children with. I'm just curious because the one who rubs the resin, the black resin on his face is because we glow in the white and I can't help that. It's just the way I'm born, but that's how star woven cloth comes. And so I don't comment on your looks, your people, your... If you need help, you let me know what's wrong and what needs fixing. I will make a note. I will bring it back to terraforming and whatever. We will get back to you as soon as we can be helpful. That's it. Why is there so much hate and so much interference? I really fucking hate this version of human. I spoke to inside. I, I mean, like, it's like somebody called the fire chief... Because, like, I mean, I'm a red boa. I am above the fire chief. And I don't know what you did with my fucking Reich. R-I-K-E. Looking the proper way with coin, at master of coin, and whatever. I mean, who the fuck is running the show? Is it all of Southeast Asia? I'm just curious. Fucking eradicate them all. If that's what they've done while I've been sitting here waiting.
in Americana, Puerto Rican, white, Cuban, and Puerto Rican space of I'm not either, but apparently I had your appreciation in Hispanic whatever, which pissed off the Dominicano in the San Remo, S-A-N-T-A-R-E-M-O. I don't know why, modus operandi, but Peter and Sarah lives in something on Long Island called Kings Park. K-I-N-G-S-P-A-R-K. I think he lives in the more upper echelon. Nobody gives a shit. Uh, but the poor section is a little beach bungalow town called San Remo. S-A-N-R-E-M-O. Has some importance somewhere on the docket. D-O-C-K-E-T of hurting humans for daring to hurt my laboratory work and my reason for being here. 